Hey guys, it's Corey Alexander. Just wanted to say thank you for watching Moto America on YouTube. Make sure you smash that like and subscribe button. Your championship points leader, the number one in his original grid spot, as is the number nine, second in points. Revs are up. Here we go. Medallia Superbike race number two, scheduled for 15 laps. Now 14 laps, and there goes Petrucci up the inside. And Danilo Petrucci will take over the lead, but Cameron Peterson uh, looked like he was going to have none of it. P.J. Jacobson running there in third. As you pointed out, Greg, another guy with a ton of experience in these kind of conditions. How about Ashton Yates there in fifth? Looked like Hayden Gillum in sixth. And remember, we have got a number of guys coming from the back of the grid that are going to be moving their way forward, or at least trying to. So Danilo Petrucci trying to find his way around New Jersey Motorsports Park, a racetrack that is known for mm, grip being at a premium. Let's put it that way, especially in the wet conditions. So this first lap or two is going to be where is the grip? Where can these riders possibly find the traction they need? We're going to keep an eye on those lap times after they come through on their next lap to see exactly how slow the track actually is. So we'll keep an eye on that as we go. Now keep also in mind, and looks like it's PJ. PJ uh, Jacobson has tossed it away between turns one and two. Wow, and the motorcycle just missed him. Wow. So that one, unfortunately, that bike is a write-off. So PJ, our first victim that we've seen so far. You're going to see PJ's bike come into the bottom right part of your screen on the left there. You're going to see the bike ripping along and watch this bike flip Greg and just disintegrate lucky that PJ what didn't get too underneath that bike because he did make contact has already wrapped up a national championship here in Moto America so riding that bike Ashton Yates having a good go at it but there's Matthew Skultz he'll go up the inside take position well he just ran the fastest lap of the race Greg 31-7 from Matthew Skultz he's some 10 and a half seconds behind our race leader it's up to Gagne to win this championship on his own as Gagne looks over his shoulder. Don't see that very often from the 2010. Oh, Moto Matthew GT just had a little bit of a moment yeah. there as you saw his foot slip off the peg. The pass that he'll make, hopefully, Greg, I, I know Matthew, it'll be, it'll be a clean one. There'll be no risk involved. He wants to go to the front, does Matthew. He just wants to get Pygon in nice and clean and smooth and then try to get to the front. There goes Skulls. He tips it on by Gagne. Gagne does the right thing. Don't want to risk it all. Now here's Matthew Skultz hounding 45 Camp Peterson. So it's fresh and lean progressive Yamaha R1 versus Westby Racing Yamaha R1 as Peterson had a look over his shoulder. And of course he is because he's going to hear something. Here goes Skultz, the South African with a new contract, 30 years old. And Peterson gets right back around him. He knows Matthew's there now. And these guys have pulled away ever so slightly from Ganya. You can see now. It's a big gap there. So, oh, oh Peterson Cam. gets really Oof. shot out of the seat there. And let's see if Matthew, Matthew's going to go past him up that hill. All the while, Danilo Petrucci has an 8.4 second lead as Skultz moves his way into second place. It's a great camera angle right there. It's right as they start to screw the throttle on, Greg. You go through a big kind of compression where you go from downhill back to uphill. It has to do with how they're going to manage the pivot front and rear in terms of the bike pitching forward and creating heat in the how long how easy the stroke is on the fork and the shock and there's so many factors involved in that full wet setup to the hybrid setup that she's talking about so and cameron then, peterson's kind of gathered it back up it's amazing when you have somebody just a little bit quicker in front of you kind of showing you the way around and that's exactly what you're seeing and this might be what jamie talked about the later starts of the race but here goes the 22 now he's right on the back of the number one so ashton yates is having an unbelievable run on that aftercare high uh, Hayes Racing Shiby BMW, that fresh and lean progressive Yamaha of Jake Gagne could come under fire. And these are valuable points, Jay. We talked about it. The live championship, if it finishes this way, it's going to be one point advantage for Gagne. Jake Gagne, that's yeah. going to be add in for Petrucci. These two guys just another keep fighting each other, it. don't they? Oh, Matthew took another shot in turn five. Cam turns it back up underneath them again. Both these guys were laughing about battling with each other yesterday. They said they hadn't had a good race in a long time. Now they got two days of it. Danilo Petrucci out front is managing the lead. He's keeping it right around 10 seconds as the 45 has another look over his left shoulder. Wow. So Skultz will go by his right shoulder. 
Yeah, these hear, guys are just going to hear the crowd yeah. whistling, Jay. Like, they're so excited to see this passing. A little bit more of a handful. And look at these guys. They just keep going back Yikes. and forth. Yeah, it was a close one. See, the problem with that situation, oh. if you're Peterson, who continues to have struggles with the right side of the rear tire, is that if you're in that situation in the dry, you leave yourself a little margin to grab a little bit more lever. So that's where things oh. get tense. <laughs> These things are starting to spin up pretty good now. They are. Because if the track, honestly, Greg, if the track really wasn't that wet. Oh, there goes Cam. Cam. Peterson. Just oh. lost the rear end of the motorcycle. A little bit too much throttle. And he's got to pick it up. Oh, my gosh. And I didn't see Ashton Yates right behind uh, Gagne there. Stuck, I didn't see him. When he caught Gagne at the last lap, he stuck oh, his he leg broke the oh. clip on. Let's watch what happens here for those of you watching or around the world or watching here on site. Well, he Peter's hits the patch here. And that's, Bam, a, you, that's you've, ice. you've pointed that out before. Like even Petruccio on that last lap, better watch out. Okay, so that left clip on right there dug into the ground and it looks like, so okay, it's there. It spins around and then you'll see it right now. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh, it's not, it's oh, not there. It's not there. And I don't see Ashton Yates anywhere. No, he stuck his leg out, Jason. Oh, he did. Okay. I saw it. There was about a lap ago. Look at the rain now. This is, this is Daniela Lewis, who was running sixth in this race, I believe. Unbelievable. He was on a up backup to on a motorcycle. borrowed R1. Yes. He started from the back of the grid. And see, this is what happens. Now the rain has really started. Now the conditions are really, really treacherous. Everybody's just got to kind of get rolling around. The Ducati spinning onto the front straightaway we go. Danilo Petrucci, who stands up and takes a win. Well but that is Superbike race number two. And here comes Matthew Skultz working that throttle as much as he can. He'll get second place, 6.6 .6 behind. And here comes your reigning national champion, your points leader. Shaking his head, but he makes it and he gets a podium. Man, that's a huge result for Massive. him. Massive. Yeah, this is, this is what we wanted to see. We've got a fight now at Barber. Now, here we go. Hector Barbara is running in fourth uh, on the 80. Another run of the riders that started from the back of the grid. Keep in mind, we've lost Cam Peterson. We've lost Ashton Yates. And we lost Denella Lewis. But here we go. Hector Barbara is going to end up finishing fourth in this race. He comes across the line. And behind him should be... Vision Wheel M4 X Star Suzuki's Jake Lewis. Cam Peterson. Oh, Cam Peterson. Yeah, he picked the bike the, up. I thought I saw the clip on broke off. I, did he ride did, one he may, have, he may have. So Cameron Peterson ends up fifth, but the crowd cheering on. Danilo Petrucci, your live championship.